Hello, welcome to my channel. My name is Shilpa and uh, I received my Faber Castle uh, Polychromos color pencils, the set of 12 yesterday. I wanted to open it in front of the camera but um, I've had the camera position all wrong. But anyways, I opened this just now <laughs> and um, I want to show you the colors and these are the colors and uh, i think they are so beautiful uh, especially uh, the green one over there at the top um, anyways uh, what i'm going to do is i'm going to swatch it and also make a uh, coloring uh, you know uh, design that green one is what i'm pointing out at that i loved so much uh, so i have this uh, flower here and um, what I'm going to do is I'm going to first swatch it over here and uh, then uh, go on to apply the colors onto the petals all right onto the flower basically so I'm using the white pencil just to uh, kind of um, secure my highlights so when I work with other pencils other color pencils uh, you know it it will retain that highlight and that's what I'm doing here right now so basically yeah I'm just having fun with these colors uh, this is walnut brown I believe and I sharpened it using my Derwent sharpener which I love so much it gives you a really really sharp edge but I just sharpened one pencil uh, I didn't have the patience to sharpen all the other ones so this is walnut brown and I'm going to uh, basically just color and that's what I'm going to be doing uh, in this whole video and uh, that's black and it's just called black and the number is 199 the walnut brown is 177 and yeah so I'm basically just coloring this and um, just watching the greens the greens that are there are emerald green and light green emerald green is 163 and light green is 171 moving on to the magenta 133 and um, i was just trying to get the hang of uh, the the pencils and uh, you know just seeing how much i can press into the um, pencils next up is a light ultramarine so i'm going to do one petal uh, with the color and then mix up uh, the colors in the other petals that is scarlet red and that is uh, 210 that's a really beautiful color I'm just checking on my <laughs> color wheel uh, and then we have uh, the patello blue I don't know how to pronounce this 110 uh, and I'm just mixing uh, the red and uh, that blue up and then of course I'll give the one of the other petals the pure blue also <laughs> moving on uh, to the orange it's the cadmium orange 115 and i'm going to uh, color that petal as well and then i'm mixing in a red the scarlet which gave it a beautiful orangey red color moving on to cadmium yellow all these pencils are so awesome and um, they are supposed to be uh, I, I just wanted to read out what these pencils are as uh, you watch So, uh, these are high quality acid free pigments in bright colors, unsurpassed light fastedness that means that the colors will last for a really really long time, soft vibrant color will last for a very very long time and meaning the colors 
uh, will remain on the painting for a very very long time soft vibrant color lay down and uh, water resistant and smudge proof thick 3.8 mm lead and high break resistance due to um, uh, secural bonding process I don't know what that is but uh, I can say that the colors are so vibrant and so uh, beautiful and you can see that yourself in this video that it is so vibrant although I just wanted to try uh, something and uh, I went in with the distilled turpentine from camel and I wanted to blend these colors out so I'm I dipped the brush into the turpentine and again uh, uh, kind of smoothened out all these colors and wiping in between each color I started from the lighter color anyway this is not about what I'm drawing I was just having a lot of fun <laughs> with the um, uh, colors and uh, yeah that's what I'm doing in this video uh, so I just wanted to say that I loved these uh, pencil colors uh, they are expensive uh, professional quality watercolor pencils and um, mm, I just wanted to buy the set of 12 so that you know I can uh, check them out and see if it would be a medium I would like to use and uh, I guess it is <laughs> I really like them uh, only the uh, light ultramarine I was not too happy with but I don't know I, I still have to make a lot of drawings with that so I just went on to apply another layer also onto the color just to see how um, much more deeper that it gets. That's what I'm doing. Anyway, so this was just a swatch card I made <laughs> for myself for reference. It's always a good idea to do that. And I'm just giving the finishing, finishing touches to uh, this flower and just adding some colored atoms or something like that <laughs> uh, that was the only point of creativity I had in the video nonetheless uh, this is my video for the swatches of the polychromos pencils really smooth and soft um, and uh, creamy actually uh, I love them and uh, I hope this video is useful to you and um, yeah I just hope this video was useful to you in making your decision uh, to buy them uh, but you know uh, I have got other colors from Faber Castle with the normal ones they also are very pretty but um, this is definitely a lot more vibrant these colors so anyways that was for uh, my uh, chit chat with you guys uh, I'll see you in my other video thank you so much for watching have a wonderful day Bye-bye.